Hey y'all, okay, um, so I wanted to make a quick video. I'm gonna share this video in the description. Please watch it. You know, it's a year old. A lot of people, like, I think there's probably something to it because, well, probably a few things. I'll get into it later, but pay attention to the center and excuse the language, which I think it kind of adds to it, but look in the center and you'll see that it does look a little scary at first because it's like kind of dark looking, but then it gets to a certain point and it starts to change colors. You'll see that what I'm talking about when I share the video. You might have come across it. You might have seen it before. Um, and then she says something at the end. Um, now, also, you'll notice that sirens are going off. Like, as kind of... Anyways, you'll see what I'm talking about. Take a look. I wanted to also do a quick video to share... Yes, oddly enough, I don't think people really, too many people are probably on Twitter or whatever that's watching me, but I shared something and I had said that, you know, like I won the lottery the first time I played. <laughs> I should have known myself better, you know, but there's always a but. <sighs> and I would have won with like three other people. So anyways, I wanted to share that. Talking about being a winner. <laughs> anyways. And then, um, I think that was one other thing. Okay, yes. Because, you know, of course, I've had my trauma. I've had, I've gone through a lot. And it's like, I've lived it, you know. So, um, that makes sense, you know. Um, so, I guess people have really just had to survive, like, financially. And it's like, here I am. But, like, I just had to survive physically, you know. And then, um... It was almost like, uh, you know, I, you know, the nieces and stuff, I was like, you know, told them, eventually realized just to tell them because of the little things they would say or something. I was like, well, you know, not everybody's reality is the same, you know? And, um, but it's still, it's still, is it fabricated? I'm still fabricated, um, that I'm trying to show and tell these things. And it's still just like a blank stare, you know? It's like, like I said, my sister says, I don't worry about things I can't control. But at the same time, it's like they're not even thinking at all, you know? And, um, I don't know. It just looks like a sad reality to me. Especially knowing that the proof is right here and then I'm still getting called an idiot, you know? And, um, and I know I'm not alone, I, it, you know? Um, and to go back to the other thing when I, um, to the other story, eventually get to all that. Um, because that one kid goes along with everything else. Um, as far as I remember, he was like a ward of the state. You know, he was talking about being in trouble when he was young. Da da da. Ward of the state. They have time with these children, but they can't they can't work with them. You know. Okay, but I wanted to say really quick, the lady at the convenience store after that, when I she was like, I remember you that worked there. You know, and uh, I was like, Yeah, and I got pulled over a week and a half later, and she's like, You did. And, you know, she was a little startled, you know, and I don't want people to worry or be afraid or nothing, you know. And I was like, oh, well, I just think it's a coincidence, and, you know. And then the next time I see her, it's like I couldn't even face her because I, I had already got, I got the cops called on me to get an AT&T, you know. I haven't had to deal with these, I want to say a cuss word, in five, six years, you know. This is the major BS to me, part of my language, you know. I'm not perfect. And I'll take responsibility where responsibility is due, you know? <sighs> but anyways, okay. One last thing. The second thing that I did receive, which was so long ago when I was really young, it had did have something to do with people, you know? And I'll, I'll get to that next time. All right. Uh, God bless. See y'all soon.